How special was it to be the first winner here? Really special. Um, I mean, this is kind of a unique tournament for us. Um, this, the community feel is something else, and the fact that the Oneida Nation have embraced the LPGA and um, just the, the way they view women in their community is really neat. And it's inspiring to us, actually. Like, we usually wear the, you know, uh, going in and trying to inspire others, but I think I feel like it's the other way around here. And um, yeah, honored to, honored to be their first champ. Rare for a tournament to be a baby and take off the way it has in just two years, though, isn't it? Yeah, I think part of it is we're in a smaller community, and um, the LPGA's always done well in smaller communities where everyone's kind of got behind it as their event and in, embraced it. And um, when we're not competing with other big events going on, we we, we certainly appreciate the the crowd support and um, the fact that local businesses get involved and want to make it bigger and better and um, I think that's that's a nice side of things too that we often miss out on in the, in the big smoke. So where did you uh, stash the Sky Woman Trophy and how? how? It is proudly sitting <laughs> uh, on the wet bar at home so yeah you, you can't walk past it and not stop and admire it so it's yeah something I, I look back on with fond memories and glad to have that memento. How are you playing this season? Yeah started off pretty well so uh, Top, top five, a couple of top 20s in there. Game feels good. Um, all these young girls obviously keep pushing us oldies, so <laughs> got to stay stay sharp and keep on my toes. Yeah, but 31 under, the score to beat from last year was say Young. That was just ridiculous. Yeah, she went lights out, which, I mean, good for her. Obviously, yeah, breaking the record, um, all-time 72-hole record, which was cool to, cool to watch. And um, I'm sure she'd tell you it wasn't easy, but she had fun doing it. So I don't know if we'll quite see that again this year, but yeah, certainly girls like to make birdies out here and it's always always fun to watch. So is that what you kind of just tell the other ladies on tour about this tournament? You talked about it earlier, about just mm -hmm. trying to drum up even some more interest already. But this is such a welcoming place and a fun course to play. It's got everything you're looking for. Oh, for sure. Um, I mean, anytime you can make this many birdies, I mean, you want to be there. You don't want to miss out on that. and. Um, obviously, the girls, if they if they have missed this event in the past, they're paying attention to the scores and and want to know about the Green Bay area and and, and the golf course. So, um, I think yeah, you'll see a, probably the best field ever that we've assembled in three years. And um, yeah, certainly the talk amongst the girls is everyone's looking forward to coming back here the July four week. All right, we'll see you then. Thanks, Catherine. Looking forward to it.